Peak 360 is a screen recording tool included in the Articulate 360 suite. It allows you to quickly record and share screencasts, and we use it a lot to respond to storyline questions we receive via email because it's a great way of explaining by showing rather than just telling. Here's how it works. You can launch Peak 360 from the Articulate tray, and you have the option to also install it in your Windows system tray for easy access. Once you've launched it, before you start recording, I recommend clicking on this gear or cog to open up the preferences. Here is where you can set the commands to pause or stop the recording. Usually we're using Peak 360 to make pretty short informal screencasts, so we don't normally need to pause during the recording, but we will change the shortcut for stop recording. It's a good idea to make this shortcut a key or a combination of keys you don't ordinarily use. If you use something such as the escape key for stop recording, the problem you'll run into is that you may need to click escape as part of the process you're demonstrating, and then you'll end your recording by accident. So I changed this to a unique shortcut that I'll remember. Once you've set your shortcuts, go ahead and open the app again, then click new recording. Select the app or window you want to record, and the recording controls come up. If necessary, resize the recording area by dragging the handles on the sides or in from the corners. Grab the arrows in the center to reposition this window. You can select the Windows icon to reset it back to full screen or to switch the window. If you want to record narration, select the microphone icon and make sure you have the correct mic set for the audio source. When you're ready to begin recording, click the red button and a countdown begins. When you're done recording, use the shortcut you set earlier to stop recording. A window pops up and it's your chance to preview the recording. If you're happy with it, rename it and select Upload. It'll take a few seconds to process. When it's ready, you can reopen the Peak 360 app and select the arrow alongside the thumbnail for the sharing options. Select View on Articulate 360 to open your course on Review 360, where it's been automatically saved. Select Copy URL to paste the Review360 link into an email or message. In addition, an MP4 of the recording has been created and saved on your computer. Select View in Folder to access it. This is great because if you like how it turned out and you want to reuse this video in a Storyline or Rise360 project, it's there and ready to go. That's an overview of Peak 360. By the way, if you ever find yourself reaching out to the training team for assistance, feel free to record a peak walking through your issue and it can help us help you troubleshoot.